Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Casper's Eye. How the devil are you, mate? This bloody weekend, all right? Make sure after this video, you go out and you do something this weekend. Don't waste it, okay? Go out there, ramble it, and do the thing. Today, we're going to be looking at a channel called Fearsome Top 5. Make sure you go over to his channel, subscribe, and do the thing. Let's get them up to 40,000. Okay, they're on 37.8. Let's get up to 40,000, mate. Come on. Come on. Come on. Anyway, this video is called Five Scary Ghost Videos of Spirits Caught on Camera. Well, the other video, mate, a couple of days ago, right, that was epic. And there were spirits, mate, fla flashing around left, right, center, willy nilly. And they look legit to me. So let's see if these ones look legit. Without further ado, da dilly day. Let's do this. Go on, Fearsome Top 5! Fearsome Top 5. Welcome to Fearsome Top 5. Although they're rarely seen with the naked eye, dark entities are always lurking around us, and sometimes they're even caught on camera. Well, today we're gonna take a look at five scary videos of what these entities are capable of. Ooh. Number one. No, no, no. TikTok user Ms. Gore is a mom to three kids that's been living with terrifying activity in her home. Back in 2012, her and her kids moved into a new apartment in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. And from the moment she stepped foot inside, something felt off, and her intuition was screaming at her to leave. But out of desperation, she went ahead and moved her family in. Within the first month of living there, she began having terrifying dreams of dark figures surrounding her in bed. Oh. And coincidentally, around the same time, her son began complaining of seeing a black silhouette of a- Oh god, mate! You know what this is, isn't it? Eh? Right? You know what it is, it's sleep paralysis, mate. On another level! man that he called the terrible guy. Occasional run-ins with this dark figure left her son horrified, and over time, the activity in the apartment got worse. Well, one night, her daughter recorded a short video with her Nintendo DS, and as oh, she no. played the video back, what she saw filled her with fear. Oh god, oh god, I don't know if I want to see this, mate. Oh. Did she say just go away? Did she just say go away? Mate, that shadow bastard just walked past it. Recording on the Nintendo DS? What the F, man? I didn't even know you could do that. Look! As her daughter was filming towards the TV, something can be seen walking by. A dark figure quickly moves from right to left, but the young girl didn't see anyone in person. And when she showed this video to her mom, she was just as confused. So did she actually catch a glimpse of the terrible guy her brother was seeing? Oh, man! I'll let you decide. Because it was transparent as well, right? Number two. Number two. The basement is a live escape room experience located in Las Vegas, Nevada. And although the experience isn't necessarily supposed to be scary, the things caught on the security cameras inside definitely are. Rumors of a real haunting taking place at the escape room have been circulating amongst the people that work there. And recently, one of the employees found out these rumors are true. After arriving early for her shift and preparing the building for the day's reservations, she heard a loud banging coming from somewhere in the building. She immediately pulled out her phone to document the occurrence, and this is what she caught. Okay. I've got to start doing that, mate. Any sort of, like, any bang, twitch, or whatever, mate. All right? I've got to start putting out my phone. It seems like everybody just pulls out their phone nowadays. Oh, what was that? Put out your phone. Get your phone out quick. Investigate. <laughs> Holy shit. Hello? Oh, fuck off. That is some really pissed off ghost, mate. Rambo in it, yes. Oh, shit. To be fair, that could have been anybody. 
doing that and then just ran off down the end there, look. A door in the back can be seen eerily slamming shut over and over on its own. But as she got closer... Is she recording on a Nintendo DS as well? The door suddenly stops moving. And as she bravely opened the door to take a look inside, no one could be found. So it was about half an hour later, though. She opened the door about half an hour later, let's be honest. Could this escape room really be haunted? And if so, why was this ghost throwing a temper tantrum? Hey! You alright, mate? How's it going? Number three. Over on the really haunted YouTube channel, a man named continues to deal with the dark presence in his home. And for the past two years, he's been uploading videos documenting the strange activity he deals with every day. From objects moving on their own, to shadow figures caught prowling around his house. Mate, this channel is absolutely crazy, man. Like, the, what the hell is going on in this bloke's house? But it's on another level. House. There's no denying that Lee is dealing with something dark. He recently began recording videos using an SLS camera that tracks movement of any humanoid figures. SLS, that means super licky sexy, by the way, if anybody's uh, wondering. So as Lee stands in frame, the camera tracks his body with his stick figure. But it's soon revealed that Lee isn't the only one in the room. Can you tell me what I need to do to move you on? As Lee is asking questions with his phone, another figure appears and incredibly looks to knock his phone out of his hand before nonchalantly walking away. I was stunned the first time I watched this. Mate, what the actual F, man? Hey? What the actual F? That, sh that, that ghost just literally Will Smith that phone right out of his hand. Because what are the chances that a figure hey! would be tracked like this at the same exact time that Lee happened to drop his phone? Eventually, Lee decided to call it a night and get some sleep while leaving his camera recording. But what his camera ended up catching is downright chilling. Right, so what I was going to say is, um, people are talking about a mask. Like, literally masking off a certain area on this side, okay? Um, and then you can just sort of, like, bring in the other person. But, okay, fair enough, you can change masks. You can, like, pull them and drag them and God knows what. But it just goes to show... It, it would have been easier to just have two clips. Mask is down there to the right. Like, so he, he does that. And then you can have the ghost there flicking his phone away. And then you, but the thing is, if he walked into this area, he would disappear because it'd be masked from a different video, um, a video clip. But now he's just literally walked to the camera. So that sort of, sort of eliminates the mask. A lot of people do is they have like they put a line this is like two video footage so he stands there and the other person stands there you just take two video footage and don't move the camera so it looks like it's one thing but he just walk he, he you know he's just walked in front of the whole lot so it's not a mask waking up and see her face out looking at you what the f No way, mate. That is freaky. Mate, if I woke up and I started looking at the footage of that shit, mate. Motherfucker, I'm gone. I'm gone. I'll be moving. I don't care. All right? I know a lot of people say, Ben, some people can't afford to move. I'll fucking move into a box, mate. Oh. The only thing I see which is different now, like that, to edit something like that, mate, would be it take so fucking long for all the random shit to to be jumping about and stuff. Like that would just take so long. And this dude uploads every day at the moment. The only thing I can sort of see, which is a little bit weird, is on Lee's um, figure where the joints are. You can see like where you've got blue and blue, where they join together, where the cross is on the join. It's a slightly different shade of color, right? On on these, you don't see the different shades of color. That's the only thing I'm like, what, like, what is that about? Why, why is that? Is it because of the color difference? That'd be so difficult As to do. As was fast asleep, a figure was tracked walking over to the couch and eerily bending down and watching him. 
And clearly, this figure was feeling a little feisty as it appears to reach out and smack Lee. <laughs> this is the slap sound, right? It's fucking. This is going on another level, mate. Everything is going Lee on another level over, today. The figure begins ominously walking towards the camera before eventually disappearing. Lee is definitely a lot braver than I am because if I had spirits smacking me in my sleep, I'd be out of. That's what she said. <laughs> there. Number four. Shit. TikTok user KittyK38 is an account run by a woman named Kathy who continues to catch strange things happening in her home. Well, one day while Kathy was doing some laundry in the basement, she heard a strange noise come from the other room. She quickly grabbed her phone and began recording, and this is what she managed to catch. Okay, guys, I'm in here again. Just put some clothes in the dryer. I have all the lights on because I get freaked out when I'm down here alone, but I heard okay. something coming from, I think it was the back. That's the basement? That's the basement. Okay. <laughs> Maximum basement, please! It sounded like something slid or... Or maybe like a knocking sound or something like that. It sounded creepy. Oh, oh shit! Oh my god! Run! Run! Oh, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. There's nobody what in the here, fuck? guys. It's just me. Literally, just me. No string on that either, mate. That is weird. Okay, upstairs I go. Bye bye. As Kathy went to look for whatever caused the sound she heard, the bottom drawer mysteriously gets pulled open. There was clearly no one around her or in the bathroom when this happened. That's so weird, who mate. Or what caused the drawer to open? Mate, these paranormal videos are going to, to another level at the moment. Every what? I've got to stop saying. I've said that four times on this video. Another level, whatever, mate. But they are. They're going to other levels. Like, these videos lately have been brilliant. And from Kathy's reaction, it's clear that despite living with this entity for some time now, it never gets any less scary. Number five. Number five. Chris from the Urbex Hill YouTube channel hey. is known for his bravery as he often explores abandoned places. And every once in a while, as he makes his way through the rotting halls of these forgotten buildings, he catches something on camera that sends chills down his spine. Well, in one of his videos, he set out to explore an abandoned school. Completely alone with a camera in hand, Chris had no idea what he was about to catch on video. <sighs> oh, mate, this looks weird as hell. That looks creepy as hell, mate, in there. How do they find these places? That's straight up Silent Hill, mate. Let's go. Brings you into the light. Imagine if just writing just started going. <laughs> On the blackboard, mate. Motherfucker, I'm gone. Did you hold the key? I think I've seen this one. This is. I think this is quite old. This one. I can't remember it, but. You may have missed it, but as Chris first did. entered the hallway with lockers lining the walls, many of them are wide open. 
But after entering the room oh. at the end of the hall, then coming back to the hallway, oh. all the lockers are now closed. Somehow, something managed to close every locker that was open without making a single sound. What? But Chris didn't notice that anything had changed and continued. And there wasn't... I didn't see a, a cut. I didn't see a cut, mate. That is weird as hell. Don, he eventually made it to the old school auditorium, but as he went to peek inside, something made an appearance. Oh God, what? Oh shit. As he looked inside, someone can be seen sitting in one of the chairs. Once again, he didn't notice this at the time, but there was definitely something there. How can you see that somebody though? Near the end of his exploration, as Chris was facing the end of the hallway, something can be seen looking back. Where? Uh, oh shit. Mate, maximum light, please. What the hell, mate? Was he holding the Was he holding the sun? Oh my god, do y'all see that? Rambo it, Urbex. Rambo it. What? Yo. What? Go on, mate. Run, 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 run. An eerie ball of light can be seen floating at the end of the hallway. Chris quickly noticed this strange anomaly and continued recording until it eventually disappeared. And this was all Chris needed to see for him to get the hell yeah. out of there. Yeah. Thanks for sticking around until the end of the Shit. video. Shit. As always. the merch at caspersite.com just rambo it there you go mate short but sweet absolutely bloody brilliant anyway thank you so much mate remember what i said about the weekend okay make sure you go out and do something do the day anyway i'll see you in the next one take care bye bye